What's up, my name's Waffler, also known as Taylor. You're looking at Waffler69, a famous TikToker known for reviewing the craziest food. I got Batman cereal from 1989. <coughs> but recently, Waffler, at just 33 years old, passed away. Oh, my brother Taylor, he has passed away. What happened to him? Did he die from food? Well, let's look back at some of the most crucial moments leading up to Waffler 69's final hours. On June 4, 2006, more than a decade before he became famous on TikTok, Waffler started uploading funny videos on YouTube. I'm the best around. Nothing's ever gonna keep me down. And he made sure that no one did, even when he was targeted by haters. A ridiculous amount of people calling me fat. It's impressive, actually. Waffler kept this fun and positive vibe even after moving to TikTok. On June 6, 2021, he made his first viral food review video. Oh, yeah. There we go. Beautiful cut of steak. From there, he started sharing more funny videos of him eating weird and sometimes suspicious food. Like this weird-looking burger patty from June 2021. Seems like one of those not quite 100 percent beef maybe a little human or this fermented fish in a can <laughs> it smells like booty hole his food reviews got crazier and crazier eventually making his followers concerned about his health but he kept going to make others happy and entertained even reviewing extremely expired food on september 9 2022 he uploaded a review of a cereal from the 80s i got batman cereal from 1989 <laughs> and this cereal from 1991 on December 6, 2022. I've got Adam's Family cereal from 1991? Let's eat it. Bottoms up. Wow, that's good cereal, I swear. I'm shocked. Waffler then uploaded a TikTok on January 8, reviewing a super-sized cereal that a friend gifted him. Does it taste fruity? Does it taste loopy? Let's see. Oh, I taste. His followers joked that he should have eaten it with milk, so he followed it up with another video on January 10th. I would like to make a public apology for not putting the big fruit loop into milk, so you know what? I got y'all. <laughs> It actually does taste better. As always, his review was fun and lighthearted, but things quickly took a turn for the worse. Because unknown to everyone, his weird food reviews took a toll on his body. And this would be his last video. A day after uploading his last TikTok, Taylor was rushed to the hospital. And on January 11, 2023, at 10 p.m., Waffler69 drew his last breath at 33 years old. Although he has already left, his brother Clayton asked his fans to keep him alive by doing this. Please keep his legacy alive, watch his content that he does have out. Waffler 69's passing is an unexpected one, and his fans all around the world are grieving. One of the most positive and happy people in the world. I don't have words to describe how, how good that feels. For how many people my brother genuinely touched and helped but if there's two things you can take away from his story it's to always make the most of your time and to always take care of your health